hi guys welcome and welcome back to my channel yes if this is your first time here you're welcome and if you're returning you're welcome back if you have not yet subscribed wait till you did wait for a bit to your baby girl some slack please subscribe to my channel like and share god bless you as you do so <laughs> so on today's tutorials we're making ankara bangles and this is what I'll be using. There are different shapes and size of bangles you can use. You can use any shape or size that you want. But for these tutorials, I decided to use this shape and this size. We might do other shapes and size later, but for this um, tutorial, this is what I'll be using. So without further ado, let's get right into it. <music> so for this process this is everything i'll be using this doesn't require much i mean you can get this anywhere this is a good gun i got this on amazon for i can't remember i will put the price somewhere um somewhere on the screen i can't remember how much and this is a um, gorilla product basically this is everything you need the glue gun um if you don't have a glue gun you can use um fabric glue the bangles like I said earlier and then the fabric itself so I had already cut this uh, into this is one one inch yes like this is one inch I cut it as you can cut it as long as you want like it doesn't have like a specific length um, you can use you can cut it as long as you want this is everything I'll be needing for the for this tutorial so i'll iron this out and come back so this is it after i have ironed you want to iron it in, in like this to cover this rough side i iron in cutter on both sides like i said you don't have like a specific length for this but it's better if it's like long enough for you to to wrap and you don't have to cut or join um, if it's not enough that's why I I cut this really long um, it should be enough for just one of these so the next thing is I'm going to plug this because it has to be hot before I can use it I'm just going to plug this right now so I'm waiting for it to be hot so it can melt it has to be hot so it can melt this then i'm just waiting for it to be hot so we can get going yeah it's hot right now so the first thing to do is um we'll start with this so you put the glue on this then you bring this through and put it inside as well that's where you'll be starting from you drop this then you pick this you place it on the glue so you place it on the glue you see it then you start so we start wrapping now Hope you can see this and you wrap the next at the edge of the last one the edge so you keep folding and wrapping I hope you can see this clearly right cover and bring it in out same thing cover same thing so that's how you continue wrapping
so the last one the last one in case you did not get the first two so we'll start again the first step right then you put a little here too on the fabric and then you gum it like I said if you don't have um, this um, glue gun you can use fabric glue as well you can use fabric glue as well bring it out you wrap out that's just everything and it's very very simple it's not hard please oh <laughs> please don't forget to subscribe like and share yes so this is the last part okay so what you need to do is you measure first so this is where I want it to stop so I'm going to cut the excess out. It's better you have excess than for you to join. It makes your work um, work easy and very neat. So I'm going to cut this now. So this is this is it, right? So I'm going to fold this now. Don't forget. Fold a little to cover up these rough edges. So you fold in. After folding, you apply the glue on the fabric. On the fabric. And you fold it in. So everything is sealed. Spillages, no rough edges. This is our final result. We made three bangles. It is. This is very simple. But here it is. Very clean. Thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. I'll see you in my next video. God bless you. Bye for now.